If anything is possible, is it possible for something to be impossible? Yeah, that's impossible. What do you mean? Um, that's a hard question. Ah, uh, yeah, of course. No. Why? I'm not sure. Why not? I don't know. I didn't understand the question. <laughs> because it's still impossible. Like, not everything's possible. If anything is possible, is it possible for something to be impossible? Possibly. Uh, yes. Why? Because if anything's possible, it can be impossible. But is that possibly impossible? No. Kim possible? Yes. Alright. No. Why? Just cut. Everything's possible when you dream it. Do you think that tomatoes are a fruit? Yes. No. Yes. Yes? Yeah. 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 No. 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 Why not? What's the definition of a fruit to you? A uh, fruit should be made from the tree, but tomatoes don't. They're technically fruit because they grow on trees. No, they're vegetables. Why? Because fruits are actually vegetables. What's your definition of a fruit then? Fruit? Anything that is not meat. <laughs> Alright, are tomatoes a fruit? No, nah, man. Why? Because I consider them to be a vegetable. What's your distinction between a fruit and a vegetable? Uh, it's like that chart that you get in science class. No. No. Why not? Because. What's your distinction from a fruit to a vegetable? Fruits are sweet and vegetables have a little bit different taste. Come on, tomatoes are pretty sweet. Ketchup, right? No. Yeah, man, come on. No. Come on, man. No. Alright, whatever. Do, do you think that tomatoes are a fruit? Uh, no. Why not? What's your definition of a fruit? Uh, orange. Oranges. Yeah, but how do you make the distinction from a fruit to a vegetable? Where are you going? I thought you were going this way. They are a fruit because the seeds are on the inside. So does that mean that ketchup is a smoothie? Yes. That would actually make ketchup a smoothie in some places. Not really, because you don't have sugar in smoothie. But I mean, I mean, you don't have salt in the smoothies. No, but like, there's no, there's no salt in ketchup, is there? Yeah, there is. No, man, only sugar. No, what do you, what do you mean, sugar in ketchup? Yeah, natural sugar in fruit. Does that make ketchup a smoothie? No, I don't know. So does that mean that ketchup is like smoothies? No. Why not? Because it's ketchup. But what's what's your definition of a smoothie? It's like a crushed fruit, right? Sure. So ketchup is a smoothie. All right. So have you changed your mind about ketchup smoothies? No. No, it's just ketchup. Why? Because it's just ketchup. It's like tomato or ketchup on like the regular. No, but what's the definition of a smoothie? I don't know, man. Just drink it. I don't actually like. So you do drink ketchup then? I, I, dr I drink smoothies, not ketchup. But I'm trying to say that isn't ketchup technically a tomato smoothie? Sure, why not? What's what's your definition of smoothie? Fruit, I guess. I don't know. Tomatoes for the fruit, though. Fine. Fruit. The, are you changing your opinion about tomatoes right now? Yep. So are you a changed man after this interview? Yes. And Brady Gerard has discovered the true meaning of tomatoes. Have you ever had a ketchup smoothie before? No, that's gross. How do you think that would taste? Pretty nasty. <laughs> no, that's disgusting. Have you ever had a tomato smoothie before? Uh, no. Be honest. <laughs> Never. We need chips. Agreed. So does that mean like ketchup like a smoothie? Yes. Have you ever had a ketchup smoothie before? Yes. How does it taste? Not good. It's pretty gross. Have you ever had a ketchup smoothie before? No. I think that would taste... Um, gross. Disgusting. Have you ever had a ketchup smoothie before? I would not like to and um, maybe I should try one one day actually. Never mind. Yeah. I don't know. It's not something... Well, if you drink that, that'd be kind of not normal. Why? I do it all the time. That's Are you calling me not normal? Yeah, Matthew. Alright. Have you ever had a ketchup smoothie before? Yes. You have. How does it taste? Good. That's pretty gross. Do you drink ketchup? Yes, I do. Really? <laughs> How does it taste? I've actually never had it. Huh? You've never had ketchup? Not like as a smoothie. 
Okay, well, it's pretty good still. It tastes like tomatoes. That's pretty gross. All right. Have you ever had ketchup, like, straight before? No. Yes. You actually have had ketchup straight? Yeah. Like, with a straw? No, from a glass. That is really gross. How did it taste? Sour, sweet and sour. That is gross. If two vegetarians are having an argument, is it still called a beef? I don't know. Yeah. Yeah. Why? I don't know. Yeah, it is. Why not? Definitely. Definitely. I don't know. I think they'd have a alternative or something. <laughs> no, I wouldn't call it a beef. What would you call it? I don't know. Maybe a, a veg? <laughs> I don't know, maybe like tofu or something? Maybe lettuce. Vegetable. <laughs> Veggie bite. Two pretzel sticks. They could be having an onion. <laughs> Do you think that tomato... Before I move on to the next question, I'd like to say I like your pants. Thanks. All right, next question. What do you think the opposite of medium is? Half medium. Opposite of medium is? Any thoughts opposite of medium? Not medium. <laughs> what? <laughs> the opposite of medium. I don't think there's such thing. <laughs> Large. Hmm. Exceptional. What is the opposite of medium? Medium. Well, the government.